Welcome back to WWE News and Rumors. I'm your host, Scott May. And uh, we got some news and rumors to talk about. So, first news of the day. And also, before we get into that, this is inspired by Brandon Hodge. Thank you for that. First news story of the day is... About Elimination Chamber 2024. About the location of Elimination Chamber 2024. So, it will be taking place on February 22nd, 2024 in Australia, in Perth, Australia. Uh, it's the first WWE premium live event that's taken place in Australia, probably in history too. Like, it's, you know, it's the first premium live event that's taken place in Australia and Elimination Chamber will be in Australia for 2024. Next new story is about Matt Riddle. So I know this is old news, but Matt Riddle but it's kind of interesting. But Matt Riddle, he was released from WWE after the incident that I've been at JFK Airport. It was shot by a news broadcast called TMZ News, I think. I th yeah, I think it was called that. But TMZ News shot the whole thing uh, after Superstar Spectacle, uh, Matt Riddle... Got arrived at the JFK airport. I'm not going to explain more of it because just go look for it yourself. Um, like type in maybe Matt Riddle JFK airport incident. You'll probably find it. But probably by the TMZ news. Um, but yeah, not going to get any more detail on that because yeah. that was it. For the news, let's dive into some awesome, epic rumors. So, we're going to be still be talking about Matt Riddle. So, Matt Riddle was released for multiple reasons from WWE. Ultimately, they just couldn't get, couldn't, I guess, cover for him or deal with the issues because like you know he like turned up like intoxicated at like the um JFK airport like screaming and stuff but yeah so they uh WWE just don't want and part of the reason is uh you know how WWE and UFC uh came together and formed the TKO group well, you know, when Matt Riddle, before Matt Riddle was even in WWE, he was in UFC. And him and Dana White, the, Dana White was a leader of, and the uh, leader of uh, UFC. And uh, Matt Riddle, he does not like Dana White. And, you know, but yeah, so that's why. Second rumor is about Edge. So Edge has recently been released out of his WWE contract. So Edge is going to. So Edge didn't want to renew his WWE contract. Um, so a lot of people have been thinking. A lot of WWE fan, a lot of wrestling fans have been thinking. Probably know who Edge is. Um, it's Edge coming to AEW because Edge wants to have one final run with Christian for Edge and Christian. And, you know, so, yeah, they want to have, he wants to have run one, one final run with Christian. Christian is in AEW. Um, but, yeah, so, so Edge is going to AEW. The first day, you want to know the first day 
Edge can sign to a new wrestling company? Well, the first day is today, October 1st, 2023. So, and that is also an AEW premium live event today. So, Edge could appear at that, um, or appear at AEW on Wednesday this week and um, at AEW Dynamite. So, we might see Edge tonight on the AEW Premium Live event or on Wednesday at uh, AEW Dynamite. So, and we just wait and see. Third and final thing that we'll be talking about in this WWE News and Rumors video is about Randy Orton. The Viper, Randy Orton. So, Randy Orton has been out of WWE for a year. This past May was a year with a back injury. Um, Randy Orton has been uh, trying to get a WWE return set. We thought it was going to be Money in the Bank 2023. That didn't happen. We thought it was, We everybody thought they were crossing their fingers, thought, Edge was going to, not Edge, Randy Orton was going to turn that SummerSlam, everybody was crossing their fingers like this, praying Randy Orton were to turn at SummerSlam this year. But no, Randy Orton didn't. But we thought uh, Payback would have the Randy Orton return. But no. But Edge probably won't return the rest of this year for WWE. Um, so... Randy Orton has been spotted in the gym lifting weights, getting more muscular to have a return. And I don't know if I told you this, but he has a new theme song. I don't know if I've told you this, but he, Edge has a new theme song. It's the same title, but you know how, like, before he goes back injury? Well... <laughs> It was like more rock, kind of. Um, but this new theme song is more like uh, metal. But enough of that. So, Randy Orton has been spotted outside the WWE Performance Center. Uh, we don't know if he's been running the ropes, um, doing some bumps. But, um, yeah, so, Randy Orton could be making a return at the Royal Rumble 2024. Uh, so he could, he could, might not, because we're, um, we're, people are going to soon give him a couple months and at the Royal Rumble. Uh, he could return. So that is it. Thank you for staying for this video. Goodbye.